Christmas because this system's here to stay. And you know, this is really welcome news though, Bree, because we've needed the moisture. Yeah, we do. We always need rain here in the desert southwest, and we do have this steady stream of moisture coming in from the coast, and we even saw some widespread action earlier on today. Now we're seeing scattered showers still sticking around through the region, and we did pick up some rain about a half an inch here across the city so far that we have accumulated, but even in our higher elevations for our mountains, upwards to an inch. So we are getting a good amount of rain here from the system. There is a flash flood watch in effect here off towards our east through Mojave County, including the Kingman area. There, an inch and a half to two and a half inches possible. So flash flooding is going to be a top concern. As I always say, if you do encounter any flooding, turn around, don't drown. Very possible, especially in burn scar areas. And then even closer to the city, ponding on the roads or just very slick conditions can cause some travel concerns. So just take it easy, take it slow, and just stay weather aware. If you are out traveling here for this evening. Right now we're seeing a break in the rain here, especially on the east side. A few lingering light showers there on the west side. Even some still good moderate amount of rain falling right now through Red Rock in the Mount Charleston and even um, throughout the rest of the Spring Mountains. We are seeing that mix of rain and snow there and there is a winter weather advisory in effect there for the Spring Mountains and for Red Rock that's not expiring until tomorrow. So there we are expecting a few inches of snow for you winter weather lovers. We are going to get about three to seven inches and taking it out in about an hour from now. Still, this rain is going to continue to just train over the area. Again, staying mostly scattered. We're going to stay mostly light here too with our showers, but overall you could be caught under a heavier downpour. So if you are out late on this Thursday, don't forget the umbrella. Temperatures now, we are currently sitting in the mid 50s. Mount Charleston though, right at that freezing mark of 32. Active holiday, again, warm. We are warm today. We've been running a few degrees above average, but we are going to gradually come back down to those seasonal averages here for Christmas. Rain and mountain snow, most of the action, a lot of the heavier precipitation happening today and even early tomorrow, but we're not getting rid of the rain chances just yet, especially as the system barrels through. Winds are really going to start to pick up. Already we're seeing 22 miles per hour in Anthem, Las Vegas at 21. These are just wind speeds, not even taking into account wind gusts yet. So it is going to be gusty here throughout these next few hours, and they're really going to start to ramp up here even through Friday. Timing this out though in Futurecast, again, few showers here late Thursday and then a few lingering isolated showers, some pockets of heavier rain possible there early Friday. We do catch a break even throughout the day on Christmas, but again, we are expecting another short wave of energy to push through. Winds are going to start to pick up again here for tomorrow and for Christmas, a high of 58 through the weekend in the 50s, and we even could see some snow next week. So we might finally get some snow.